Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. I'm joined with Dan Online today. Yeah, hello. And we are going to be mad scientists today. We're going to be doing some rocket science. Because we're actually making supersonic bomber planes, which is going to be a really cool concept. So, Dan, are you ready? I am ready. All right, let's get building. All right, guys, so for this build, we are going to need a seat. Pretty sure the cockpit seat is the most efficient for aerodynamics because we really want our aerodynamics uh, like intact for this to actually work. Not to mention, I want to try and do this without any exploits. So that means this has to be all vanilla. And essentially, guys, what I'm going to do is use bomb bays for the entire fuselage of this plane. So just like this, and we're going to duplicate so many of them. There we go. I say that's enough bomb bays for this thing. And then my next idea, guys, is basically making two giant thruster sticks and smacking them on the side of this build. And you can see how um, these green arrows is not as green as these arrows. And there's also red arrows here because um, aerodynamics under here is bad. So what I can do is just add some wedges. Here we go, that solves that issue underneath. And I think to solve the issue here with these green arrows, we do this. And there we go. I've added some cones and everything is looking green. Green is good. All right, well, let's just whack on as many, many, many dragon jets as we can onto this bad boy. Elevator tail, that always helps. Let's add our small tail fins. There we go, everything is still green. And we want to turn on our forces here because we want to know where the center of weight is. It's pretty much right there. I'm going to move these dragon jets out like so. And then I can add um, some ailerons as wings. All right, well, that's pretty much the gist of my idea. Now the question is, can we go mock? All right, let's do it, let's get going. Oh, a little wobbly. Hang on, here we go. 700 miles per hour. There we go. Immediately, we uh, we got mock on the first try. So that just goes to show, guys, that aerodynamics is key in this game. All right, let's try and turn around before we hit the end of the map. Oh, okay. Well, we, uh, we hit the world border. <laughs> Really want to test these bombs, and I've actually spent time delaying every single bomb. So they drop like this. Oh my gosh, we're going so fast. The bombs are like tripping out, if you can see that. There we go. Oh my gosh. All right, let's let's try and get a little lower to the ocean. Oh, this thing is... Oh. <laughs> This plane is very wobbly. Oh, can we can can we even stable out? I, don't, I have no idea. All right, we're good. We're good. All right, let's uh, try and go to those mock speeds again. Here we go. And uh, let's drop our payload. Let's see the spread. Okay. Wow, that spread was awesome. It goes pretty far. No surprise when you go and get these ridiculous speeds. What happens if we drop our bombs spinning around? Oh, God. Okay, well, <laughs> that's not good. All right, well, for a quick 10-minute build, I am pretty happy with this. So, let's go show Dan. Hello, Dan. Have you finished your build? I have finished my build. So, awesome. Okay, well, I'm really curious. Let's see it. All right. So, it's the propeller stick of doom. Whoa, use it's, propeller? It's, it has, yeah, that's surprisingly efficient for the amount of drag they have, because they only have, like, four points of drag, and you can cover them really easy. Right, yeah, makes sense. Because at the moment, um, I haven't used any glitches. Would you like to try it? Uh, I mean, well, let's uh, let's just see um, the size comparison to uh, my build, because I'm going to show you it now. Here it All is. Right. That's oh, quite similar, actually. Yeah, so if it essentially went for the same idea with the thrusting sticks, <laughs> that's pretty much the most efficient way to do it in Trailmakers. Go mock. But yeah, I use the dragon jets. I'm surprised you didn't do any jets. So uh, seeing the propellers there is pretty cool. It's going to be hard to see if when you take it off to see if you go mock because I'm pretty sure you'll go out of the render distance. So let's just try and fly together, I guess. Okay, uh, let, let's see if you can keep up. Challenge, okay. What, what if you go like over here and face like the same way? Yeah, let's, let's uh, face I, out into like the... I'm facing a nice uh, way to take off. Here you go, face, face oh, out into the ocean. Yeah, 
Okay, well, that should work. All right then, let's uh, let's get going. Let's see uh, let's see if we go mock. I know I do. Okay. Oh, oh, oh I'm a little wobbly. I. Am Whoa! Also you're a so quick. Wobbly. You're gaining on me. All right, I'm hitting mock. Oh, we did it at the same time. I think, I think you have a higher top speed than me. That is so cool. I, I probably do. You know. All right. Well. Yeah. I'm, yeah. You, you're going faster now. I'm gonna drop my bombs. Here we go. So oh, my, oh, oh, never mind. <laughs> Let's save the bomb dropping for uh, the practice. <laughs> the map isn't quite big enough for us right now. All right, this time, as soon as we hit mark, let's drop our bombs at the same time. I want to see how All much right. devastation we can do. All right, three, two, one, go. Oh, I had a little bit of bump there. I'm probably not as stable as you. Uh, it's not that stable. Don't worry. Here we go. I'm dropping my bombs. I already threw mark. Oh, no. Yeah. I haven't gone through mark yet. Uh, there's some bombs. <laughs> We're so can fast, even, I can't like, even so see them. Up, I don't think I can yeah. even see my... Uh... Oh, I am freaking oh, out no, here, I guys. They just reached the ground. Ah, uh, okay. All right, well, I'm pretty sure we have the same, like, bombing drop. Like, um, it's just a giant I spread. Have more bombs than I, I have a lot more bombs, yeah, definitely. <laughs> That's so many bombs. Right, well, I guess we, um, well... We need some kind of target of some kind, I guess. So uh, let's spawn in a vehicle or a target and uh, we'll try our best to do some Mach 1 bombing runs of the carrier. So do we go at the same time or do does one of us go first? Like, what do you want to do? You know what? Let's let's do it separately. So uh, I'll let you go okay. first if you want to get into the air and line up. I'll get, I'll get into the air. And uh, I, guess, I guess I'll just spectate. I'm still going like 400 though, so... It only I can only now see the target, which Oh you're coming from behind me. Oh there we go. Oh what? That's it. Nice dude, that was actually quite accurate. Let me uh let me have a closer look at that. Oh yeah, oh yeah, you you you, 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 you definitely hit it, alright. <laughs> There's no denying that. Are you gonna do a retry? Oh here it comes. Holy nice. smokes! <laughs> I was just going to see the damage I had done, but I figured I'd try one more time. Wow. Oh, that's pretty good. Yeah. All right. Well, I guess it's my turn. So uh, let's repair the target. All right. I am taking off. The thing is about with my plane, there's just so much thrust. It's actually really unstable. Like, I'm sure you guys can tell when I try and turn. Like, oh, 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 okay. Oh, that, that's looking... <laughs> Yeah. I guess I just have to go out slowly, try and get myself nice and in the right position, I guess. A bit to your left, I think. Uh, I... Come on. Stay stable. Oh, All right, uh... dropping the bombs. Oh, I did uh, a roll. Yeah. I did late. a roll. Yeah, too late. Uh, no. I didn't even manage to go muck there, so that's pretty disappointing. I want to... Ah, uh, neither did I, so... I might have to... to I might have to add some more stability to this thing, because, damn, I'm freaking out. Attempt number two. Do I have enough space to go muck? Probably not. Why is this so... <laughs> Freaking unstable! <laughs> having a death wobbles. That's what it is. Wow. Okay. Well, I might need to do some slight adjustments to this. This is crazy. Kind of reminds me of how like um, insects fly, right? Where they just very erratically, but kind of looks cool too. Okay. So I've added some simple tail fins. This probably might help. I guess. I I just don't know really. <laughs> but uh, let's just test it out because I really want to be able to hit the target. Because Dan did it successfully. I'm coming with you. Here we go. Oh, oh no. Oh. <laughs> I can left behind. <laughs> oh, it feels a little better, actually. You know what? I, that's... I can manage. I can manage with that. All right. Okay, let's turn around. I really don't know if I'm heading in the right direction. Uh, yeah. Here we go. Here we go. Mock bombs too late. I'm definitely oh, way too yourself. late. I hit myself. As <laughs> what I want to do is, like, line myself up on the straight trajectory and then focus on going mock, I think. Oh, you know what I could do? I'm going to place a beaker down. There we go. So I can see where I'm supposed to be going. This is uh, this is very handy. That's actually not a bad idea. All right. Let's uh, let's stable out, guys. We're so finicky. Okay. There's my aim. Come on. Stay straight. It's probably my vertical stabilizer as well. Not helping. Bombs away. Here we go. That's late. No. Oh. Far over. <laughs> You have to oh, you drop them see, so oh. early. <laughs> yeah, you have to drop a, like like a solid twenty seconds before you roll for the targets. It's insane. that is insane. Where did you go? Um, I'm making my I way back. I lost you. I'm making my way back. Are we gonna miss? Okay. But I'm gonna drop oh, my bombs anyway. I hit myself. Ah, uh, too late. 
Dude, I'm hitting the cliff. I'm going that fast. I'm hitting the cliff. I think I need to add more stability. Still, we're still getting a little bit of wobble at these crazy speeds. Oh, oh, here we go. Here we go. Dropping the bomb. Oh, oh I hit myself. Hit that was a ton of explosions where, where did in the, the air. That they landed the over there? What? <laughs> they landed so far away from where I wanted to drop them. Do you think dive bombing on the target is a strategy? Well, dive bombing at Mark 1 is going to be difficult. Oh, I'm not even... How did I lose the carrier? Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh, oh that I'm was mid. probably the closest. I think, you, I think you got it, right? I don't know. I, I couldn't tell, but uh, it was probably most likely a miss. knowing close. me. All right, here we go. Perfect trajectory. Let's hit mark. And blow up my tail again. This is difficult, man. Also because I barely go mark one. So I wasn't planning on hitting the thing whilst going this fast. I just have to think I'm going in the right direction. I'm oh, not... I hit it at mark one. I did it. You hit it? You hit the target? Yeah, I did it. Oh, what? You did a better job than me. Here we go. I'm going the wrong way com oh, completely. Oh, I, I, dis I, I despawned the target, but I, I, can, I can see that it broke. You just spawned the target? No! I was gonna miss yeah, anyway. No, no worries. <laughs> I, I was I gonna miss. I different targets. It's, it's not as big, so uh, good luck. <laughs> this is very difficult. Okay, okay, all right, all right. It's clear that I'm not going to hit a target, but we're gonna experiment with these bombs a little more. I just made like a shotgun explosion of, of bombs. Like they were going so far and so incredibly fast. I think I just want to do some tests against the cliffs. I think that would be the best way for us to see the damage we can pull off here. I don't know how I managed to do this, but... What did you manage to do, Dan? Look on the map where I am and just take a look. That would spoil it. Well, it says you're on the cliff. I am indeed on the cliff. I'm going to head over there right now. Let's try and get some mark. I want to see how much damage I can do. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, hit mark. I don't have enough space. Abort! Oh wait, did you land oh. on that little no, rock? No, I, I didn't land. I, I tried to take off, but like I'm at, I'm at full thrust. Wait, what? What is? What's happening? Yeah, I don't know. I can't do anything about this. <laughs> You're like glued. You're like going backwards. You're glued no. to the rock. Here, let me help you. <laughs> Get shredded by the propellers. You're stuck, dude. I... How did this even happen? Like this is what it should have done. These, like, explosion paths we're making, these trails of explosives are so cool. Those look really cool, doesn't this it? This is why I want to keep testing on the mountain. What happens if I go upwards, like, directly into the sky and then drop my bombs? I don't think I can hit mark against the gravity before I hit the skybox. Please don't hit the skybox. Oh, oh we hit again. the skybox. You phased out of the map? Yeah. Wow, dude. I crashed into the ground Bro. over the water. No, I should have just went through. We're breaking the multiverse. All right, here we go. I'm just going to do a bombing run at Mark and see what happens. There we go. What? That was epic. If you're going for accuracy, oh, this is not the way to do it. But if you're going for sheer like spread of bombs like this, look at that. Look at that. It's still going. Oh. Do you want your enemy to fear? Exactly. This is the uh, instrument it's, it's, it's of war. You know? It's a fear factor. <laughs> All you hear is a sonic boom. And then next thing you know, 50 villages have been exploded. <laughs> Here we go. Woo! Boom, 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 boom. I've done it. I went through under the carrier. <laughs> you went under the sick. carrier? Yeah, without getting kicked out of the seat somehow. Oh, dude, that's that's crazy. That, that was kind of crazy, actually. How that close can I get to the ocean and do a bombing run? Here we go. You're going to hit yourself. Well, oh, I can I can go through the carrier. I, I, I can go through the carrier. I know I, I can. I hit the cliff. All right. Well, we've pretty much succeeded in the concept of making a supersonic bomber. Uh, me and dad have gone for two very unique designs. And yeah, it's very difficult to do accurate bombing. At least I couldn't do it. There was no way. It was just too unstable. I'd have to like spend hours tweaking and tuning this thing if I wanted it to be perfect. But yeah, I'm pretty happy with this outcome being able to make a mock jet go this fast it's a pretty cool little cool design as well and yeah oh whoa whoa dan just just doing a flyby there he goes buzzing the tower I, I was trying to go through the carrier but i don't think i'm going to be able to do that that's that's that might be a little too difficult yeah, to you might you might crash there buddy 
All right, well, that's pretty much it for this video. We had a lot of fun testing around with uh, this whole concept. Thank you so much for Dan for joining us today. And thank you guys for watching. If you liked it, leave a like and why not consider subscribing? It's free. But anyway, that's enough from me and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.